The founder of Ethereum just came out and said that he welcomes a crypto winter, guys. That's the kind of period we're in. Right when Bitcoin was crashing in 2018, there was just fear in the market. It was the mother of all buying opportunities. Haven't you looked back and said, oh, I wish I bought Cardano at three cents. Oh, I wish I bought Bitcoin at 3,000. Well, this is the type of opportunity that these guys, the founder of Ethereum, other whales, people building, as he says, people in the know are excited about because it's an accumulation phase and they're buying this stuff on deep red, just like those previous times. Here's a statistic for you guys. The last time we had this many diamond hands in Bitcoin, meaning people that have held on for more than a year without selling has reached a level of 61%. That's what we're at right now. The last time that happened was 2016 and 2020. What happened right following that? In 2017, we had the massive pump in Bitcoin up to 20K. In 2020 and 2021, we had the massive pump in Bitcoin up to 65K. So this is the market telling us that it's rewarding the people that can hold on through the deep red and the pain, right? And it's always done so and it's gonna to continue to do so. And that's how millionaires are made generally, right? So. Here's some good news for all the Do Dogecoin holders out there, right? You have Elon Musk saying that Doge is gonna be accepted as a payment at a Tesla supercharging station in Santa Monica. So don't think of Dogecoin as a meme asset. Think of it as the Tesla company's community token. Every single big company is gonna have its own cryptocurrency. And so what company would you rather buy the cryptocurrency of than Tesla? It has AI, it has robotics, it's the future, it has solar, it is EV. So. The fact that we can be accumulating this stuff on red makes me agree with Vitalik Buterin that we should be excited about crypto winters like this and take advantage of the fear and pain because that is the only way to make life-changing returns.